Hi, in this video we'll be showing you how to change your blades from plastic gara modulars to carbon fibers. To change out your plastic gara modulars to carbon gara modulars, you need tools like a flathead, a Phillips screwdriver, and soap and water. So first thing that you have to do is you have to take out your side rails, but you have to take out your clip first, then you pull the side rails off. So to take off the clip, you need your flathead screwdriver. Don't apply a lot of pressure because it is plastic and it can crack. And then now you pull off your side rails. You can also use your flathead and just go underneath and just lift the rubber up and pull your rails apart. You can do this to the other side. It's the same thing. Just lift it up gently, it'll just pop out. It's just like this. Just pull it off slowly. The next step is you get your Phillips screwdriver, undo your fin kit plate underneath of the fin, unscrew two screws underneath of the plate, like this. And do not lose any of these components on the fins. So now that you've taken off your back plate on the fins, there's also a second piece on the front of the fins that needs to come out as well. And this is your front plate to hold the fins together. So don't lose these pieces. Put it on the side and make sure you have it to change out to the next blade on your carbon fiber. Now these blades just pop right out after that. And the carbon fibers slides right back in. In order to put these carbon fibers back in, sometimes they can be a little difficult. So as you can see, without soap and water, it's very hard to line up these two holes. Right here. So what you want to do is you can add a little bit of soap and water here on these rails, on the inside of these rails. Then now you can shove it in and you can see right through the holes, your foot pockets and your fin blades. Now what you can do is, you can put your plate in Now that you can put your front plate in, you can hold it together. Don't worry about putting your side rails in yet. You get your other part, your back plate, and make sure it's facing in the right direction. The point of the Cressy sign faces towards the front of the fins. And you use your um, Phillips screwdriver, not your flathead, Phillips screwdriver to put it back in. Screw these bolts back in. These screws back in here. Um, you don't want to tighten it too tight. Don't use any electric or hand powered drills. You do want to use it by hand because you don't want to over tighten these screws. It might crack the carbon fiber as well as cracking uh, your plastic blades also. Just hand tighten these, and these are solid. It's really sturdy right now, but you do need to put your side rails back in. So how do you put these side rails back in? Well, there's soap and water in here already. All you have to do is bend your blades back and pop it back into the groove of the fin. It's one side of your fin. You can do that to the other side, bend your side rails, and make sure it's all the way in. Because if it's not, it will pop out. And there you go. So you need to put your fin keeper key locks back. 
and these little devices will hold your your blade it will hold the rails to your blades and you'll see two letters letters saying DX and SX on the side of these DX is your right hand side and SX is your left side of the fin DX and SX they're left and right it's because the symbols come from Italy so your DX is your right you put it back on your right hand side there you go SX is on your left hand side what you do is you want to start on one side first and kind of roll it over to the other side and there you go this is your final product in changing out your blades and upgrading from a plastic gar modular to a carbon fiber <laughs> Aloha.